Hey everybody, this is Pastor Ben Lim here, and the Lord keeps speaking to me, you will see. We're about to see the goodness of God in the land of the living. We're about to see the promises of God unveiled and be fulfilled right before our eyes. This is the time for us to see. Some would say see. I love this passage here in the book of Job 42 verse 5. My ears have heard of you, but now my eyes have seen you. I've heard about the good news. I heard about certain controversies. I heard about certain things. I heard the whispers, the good report, but now my eyes will see the goodness of God. I will step into the promise land. I'm about to see my promises fulfilled. I'm about to see my promise land, but now my eyes have seen. Are you ready to see the face of God? Are you ready to see victory on every side? Someone say amen. I still believe right now that we're about to see a landslide victory. We're about to see exposure of corruption, injustice, and evil be exposed. We're about to see that. We're about to see President Trump have his final win and his victory and be, still be the president of the United States and win his second term. I believe that. We will see. We're about to see Many politicians and corrupt political figures go to jail, be indicted, and go to prison. We're about to see certain things happen. I still believe we're about to see the goodness of God in the land of the living. Amen. John chapter 11, verse 40. I love this. Jesus says, did I not tell you that if you believe, you will see the glory of God? Are you ready to see the glory of God? I believe we're about to see. Signed one of the miracles in the United States and in the nations. We're about to see the glory of God move and shake like never before. Someone say glory. If you believe, you will see the glory of God. Amen. It reminds me of the story of how there was an evil prosecutor of the Jews named Haman. And Haman hated Mordecai and hated the Jewish people, the Jewish nation. Haman had an evil, wicked scheme and plot. You try to destroy Mordecai and the Jewish people. However, God overturned the tables. God flipped the scripts. God is flipping uh, the swing states. God is flipping the voter fraud. God is flipping certain things. And I love it because Mordecai was honored and Esther rose up for such a time as this. We're about to see the Mordecais be honored in this season. And I believe President Donald J. Trump is a modern day Mordecai. In this country, some would say honor. You are about to see honor, recompense, sevenfold return, retribution come to you and your family in the name of Jesus. You are about to see the glory of God.